Yo, what's going on guys, All Reptiles here, and today I'm going to be building out the part two, or the 2.0 of my pond. It is going to be a lot bigger, so uh, let me show you. So, all of this red spray paint is going to be the pond, except this, because we have an invisible fence, and I don't really want to mess with that too much. Um, so I don't think we're going to do this little out, uh, push out bit, but we are going to do this push out bit maybe make it a little more seamless between the edges and whatever but um, we're also going to be taking out the pond cover of this yes it looks horrible and disgustingly dirty because I had to weed whack all of this because there are a ton of weeds and when I tried to spray paint it all just gets on the leaves and when I start digging the actual pond it's gonna be hard to see the spray paint so I just had to do a little bit of weed whacking and then uh, everything has fallen into the pond, of course, but we we're going to be taking this whole pond cover out, taking the rocks, spraying them down, washing them up, making sure they're clean-ish for the 2.0 pond, but uh, let's get into the video. I've already done a good amount of work on uh, the pond already. I have multitudes of stacked bricks and whatever. I have drained out the pond because it's been raining a lot lately, and, you know, we need to... Um, get the pond all dried up uh, and also I did not have any fish in there so all of the mosquito larvae and whatever the heck bugs or whatever uh, were laying their eggs and larvae were hatching whatever were coming out of it um, but now it looks horribly dirty um, as you can see uh, but uh, let me get some friends here and then let's start digging the pond so uh, time lapse time Just a minor hull of dirt uh, right now, and now we go uh, over there really quickly. All right, now uh, we currently cannot take this out because it's too heavy, um, but we have all of this dug out. Uh, all of the edges are the pond, uh, 
like edges, obviously. Um, but all of this needs to come out. We're going to make this a much deeper area than this was because obviously it's a bigger pond. Uh, and then the next thing we have to do is actually level out the pond because what I mistake I did with this pond is this side was super tall compared to the other side that's non-existent anymore. Um, but let's uh, let's keep digging. That's gross. That is nasty. All right, well, now it's time to wash them off. Wheelbarrow cleaning. Can get your wheelbarrow cleaning. Okay. Right off, my guy. There is weed wax bits. There is fallen stuff from fall, or uh, fallen leaves from fall. Oh, God, look at that no water. Yeah, a ton, of, a ton of mosquito larvae, all of the above, basically. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do some major cleaning to these rocks. <laughs> Probably have to grab the power washer out. I don't doubt it. But... Gross. Well. Alright, so uh, I'm gonna tell you a few updates. Obviously, the rocks have been taken out. They're over there. The uh, dirt pile is slowly building. Um, but... We have this whole area, uh, not definitely not leveled out. This whole area is towering over everything else. But uh, now we are going to take some spray paint like I did with uh, the top area to actually carve it out and uh, carve out the bottomless pit area, uh, which will be even deeper than this. And this is like 21 inches deep from uh, the top layer. So yeah, let's keep digging. You have seen me spray paint this whole entire big area. So basically, uh, this is the plan. I'm going to cut it off a little bit. Don't mind that. That was my failed attempt. Or uh, I changed my mind. So I'm going to curve it out. Keep curving, keep curving, keep curving. Let's not die. Um, curve until it cuts off here. And this is whole area, this whole like squiggle area is going to be a big, big pit. And then over here, which is my, of course you can't really see it because of lighting, uh, but this area was a little ledge. I'm just going to taper it off because it is super thin over here. It was super hard to keep rocks here on the first place. Uh, thankfully, this plant covered it up, so it didn't really do much. Um, but this will be a whole big, big, big pit. And I'm also going to deepen this, don't worry. I think I'm gonna slope it down um, instead of really deepen it. So then everything will converge on one area. So it'll be the deepest area. And look, cicada larvae thingy has come out of the ground. It is the uh, 16 year cicada whatever whatever. And it scares me. So I may or may not kill a few of these. I probably have already. I've killed way too many. But uh, we're gonna, <laughs> yay, yay. We're gonna get digging on this and hopefully by today we will have it 90% of it dug out because I definitely won't finish it today. That's too much, I'm gonna break my back to it. So a good amount of time has passed. Um, I am tired. I uh, I have dug all of this, all of 
uh, other than you know this area because those was already dug before but all of this area was me so I am super tired I think I'm gonna keep going a little bit um, I think this is going to be the end of this video um, I probably will have maybe one more part but I'm all reptiles hope you guys enjoyed there will be a part two on Thursday so make sure uh, you subscribe to the channel and uh, come see me on Thursday to fi see the hopefully finished product I, I hope uh, but you know that's uh I'm gonna keep digging a little bit but this is the end of the video I'm all reptiles see you in the next video